Right now, President Obama just arrived back in Washington, D.C. after delivering that speech this morning at KU. Garrett Haig was in Lawrence this morning for the president's speech, where he received a very warm welcome. It's emptied out now, but this morning there were more than 7,000 people here in this field house to hear from President Obama. Most of those who showed up were students fired up to hear about the president's economic proposals, and they let him hear it. The loudest applause line of the day came when President Obama called on Congress to pass a law requiring employers to pay women the same as men for doing the same job. He called that a no-brainer, and this crowd of folks getting ready to start their careers agreed. You are the White House plan today was for the president to push his plans to ease access to child care and early childhood education, largely through tax credits for working families and subsidies for the poor. He said it was time we stopped thinking about child care as just a women's issue. It is time that we stop treating child care as a side issue or a quote unquote women's issue. This is a family issue. This is a national economic priority for all of us. We can do better than we're doing right now. And the world's most powerful basketball fan said he couldn't resist the chance to be next door to Allen Fieldhouse. Of course, he went over and met with Coach Bill Self and the Jayhawk players, which got a huge reception from all these Kansas fans here in the Fieldhouse. Reporting for the Now KC, I'm Garrett Haight.